or whatever you'd like to call it, of W2E K18. Something I've wanted, I was thinking of doing for a while, um, sort of something I've never really done with the WWE game. I play them quite a lot, so I just feel it'd be an interesting sort of way to share my experience with others. I was planning to do, I filmed all the other parts, but unfortunately, for some reason, they just went really bad. So, um, I, the time limits have just mucked up and half of it cut out. So, unfortunately, I'm going to have to, I, I was going to start again and I thought it just, yeah, I'd rather just, I'm going to start midway through, which is really a kind of annoying, but I figure most people have probably seen the tutorial bit. So, um, I'm at the point, if you've played the game, um, where you get to choose how you want to do your first match. Um, and I think I attacked Bobby Roode in the last, well, in what would have been the last episode. Um, now, I believe. So we're going to start with that. It's really annoying that they've lost all the episodes. I really, uh, I've done, did so much stuff in those episodes. I'd really... I might just sort of make a previously thing, um, actually, and what I've got left, that might be a good idea, actually. I think that's what I'm going to do, actually, because I've got a lot of it. There's just bits and pieces are missing. Um, yeah, so I might do that just so you can get an idea of what's happened, because if you've played some of the career mode already, it's probably people who finish it wouldn't shock me. You'll sort of know um, what's been happening. So if you don't know my character's called the Jock, he's basically like, I'm, I'm basing him on like a American stereotypical high school footballer or type sort of athlete character. I love how... 2k like to bring sort of characters back a lot like i think in the nba series they had a guy called jackson ellis for a while he was sort of your rival and then all of a sudden i think he was just like a man was in like a agent or something i think um and that's Bar is it baron blade i think he was called he was your rival in 2k 15 and 16 i didn't really remember 2k 17 that well Oh yeah, Baron Blade, that's it. Right. I do like this, that they brought Free Roman back. This guy does keep popping up. I don't know if he's part of the story of one of my friend's creator characters. I'm guessing it's either... Uh, a friend's character because of the costume or it's just like a generic character they've made in the game. Um, I've probably gone the wrong way actually. That's, yeah, that's where i just come from. So I'm going in the locker room. I must admit, like, when I first heard that there was going to be a wizard thing, that you could only have select things, I was a bit, hmm, I don't know what to think of that. But I actually really like it because it's, it is kind of, if you look at a lot of the wrestlers who started out, if you take John Cena, for example, he didn't have his hip-hop gear to start with, so I kind of like what they've done. That you've got to build up your character by unlocking things. I really like that idea. I think that's a really, really good idea. Anything. That's um oh I forget the guy's name, Roderick Strong, that's it. That's um oh Nikki Cross, that's what I can think of her name. They don't really say anything in of interest to a lot of these people. So it's kind of annoying they haven't got voice lines, but it, it does create more possibilities, I think, in the long run. So that's probably the reason behind it. 
I don't need the seamstress. Um, no way, Jose. Has he got anything interesting? Um, that's just to get you all, um, oh, what's it called, done? Your photos, your images. Oh, that's a bit odd. Have any T-Rex gone on there? Nothing really near that. Right, I think we should leave them. It's funny that they've got the authority on there because the authority haven't been around since like 2016 as a guess. I haven't really. I can't remember for the for for love and the money, but I'm pretty sure they haven't been in like on TV for a while. It's probably been over a year. I would have thought. Probably more. Well, I'm guessing we've got to talk to that guy. Is there anybody else? Who the hell is that? Or is that just one of the generic characters? I think we does construction Clive. Um, I think that's going to be it. That's not actually his name. I just I mean, I just gave him a name. Well, I'm guessing that's what we've got to do to leave the arena tonight. Loading screens seem to be a lot quicker now than what they were. Mm, maybe this is just me, it just seems a lot quicker in a minute, I don't know. But, well, maybe that wasn't too long. Mm, we've got to speak to Baron Blade again. You know, I've, I've like sort of had avidly followed NXT for quite a while, but there's like a, a couple of weeks I did miss a few months, I think about a month ago. I uh, missed quite a few episodes for a while, um, but I really have no idea, and I feel really bad. I have no idea who Sawyer Fulton is. And I don't really, I feel like I should know. Anybody in the authority cafe? No triple hatchy. I don't know if anything really happens till you get to the bigger fight card. That's um, Johnny Gargano, isn't it? Let's see what we do have. 
Oh, I thought you had to go up to them. In the previous bit that I filmed, there was like a, you had to choose what to do. And I, on the match board, I thought you were going to have to do that again, but obviously not. Welcome to NXT, where the future is now. Coming to you live from Orlando, where really the attractions weird, are Michael many, Cole on but the only one that matters right now Michael Cole is WWE. Commentary. There's no doubt, this is one of the most exciting lineups Cole we've had in the month of commentary. Sunday, so when it was stay like tuned. The reality show. We got one-on-one -on -one action coming your way next. We have one of our breakout talents taking on some tough competition. You don't want to miss it. What if we do want to miss it? I like the signature shirt option you can have as well. I must admit that's quite a cool little thing. I sort of made it like a NFL jersey type shirt. It's not spot on, obviously. Um, it's just a quick thing I mocked up. I haven't even set much of the entrance up, to be honest. I think that's something I'm going to do. Um, and then, like, put it on to the next episode. Let's set the e The following contest up is a no disqualifications match. Making his way to the ring from Northridge, California, weighing in at 285 pounds, Jackson Stone. I always call him Jackson Stone, but then I realized that was the character from Carnage. Well, I can say that both of these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance here tonight. So I yeah, went with Jackson Stone in, but I was wanting to call him the job, but they don't have it. In victory. Allow me to point out just... It's a character I made, like, I think back in SmackDown vs. Raw 2010. Was it 11? I can never remember. It's the one that's got the... She played a lot of the WWE games in the past. I'm sure it's the, it's the one where you play a road for me where it's your own character. And I think you start off with a match against Santino Moreno. That's Here comes Cassius Ono, right? a man who fancies himself as a bit of a knockout that, um, artist. And we've seen game. him back up that claim quite a bit, Michael. And really, I was just, couldn't be bothered to make... A, I just quickly made a character. And on top of that, this match will really. undoubtedly have a big impact on where and these guys stand in the next WWE.com power can't really rankings. Come about. And there's, and there's been so much upward movement from the the rock, new faces over the past few weeks that um, dropping more than 10 spots following a loss isn't but necessarily that, out of the question. Words the job. And I just thought it was a funny character as we went with it. There's, there's like a lot of sort of inspirationalized things that come from it. Um, and we're there's, underway. There's a character Looking at these in the two men, I don't think game. there's going to be um, anything traditional uh, about this one-on-one -on -one -on matchup. You played bully. And man, I um, never get tired of watching these guys compete. And it's worth noting that we are just a few Xbox miles Xbox from the WWE compatible. Performance Center, which means As there are plenty of um, WWE hopefuls in the back studying this one. I knew it. Yeah, we knew this wasn't over. Oh, this might be glorious not for me, though. How do you sum up Stone's performance as of late? What kind of attack, what kind of tactics are going to help him here tonight? This is He's one of those situations behind, where if you're the one are. in the ring, you say it could be better. Ooh. But it could also be... Pop handle slam! That one definitely hurt. Yeah, surely, the ref... That, oh, no, you didn't really see it. Is that going to be the end of the match? That's a bit crap-like. It's not, that's a bit annoying if that is the case. I was looking for a full out match then.
I feel like putting please prevent that from happening. So I think that's a really it doesn't sort of my, my character sort of a character that's gonna just take on all comers, but you know like he's vicious. I'm sort of going for the heel side with this guy. So I don't know. Um, I think we'll go for that one. Because he's quite confident in his abilities. I feel so we will go with that. That, that seemed hardly pointless turning up for that match. Oh, exit arena again. Well, you've seen me in the ring, so why would you be excited to see what you've already seen? That really makes no sense. Um, I already spoke to him. That's um, Hideo Itayami. I don't know what's happened to him, have they sort of disappeared? I feel like, um, no, oh, is that, there's that guy again, I just want to see if he says anything, because he just keeps popping up, I don't know if it's a generic sort of thing or what. Because there's no other sort of characters that have popped up, so I don't know if, like, it's just the one... Well, I think we're going to exit and go for next week's match because I don't really feel like anything's going to change by going down that way. Saska. I always thought it was pronounced Asuka because I think in one of the Tekken games uh, if you don't play Tekken, there's a character called Asuka Kazama. But one of the Tene uh, Tenekans, one of the Tekkens, pronounced it as Asuka. And like, I like to name my pets after characters and things, and I, she's one of my favourite Tekken characters. So I named her after the, my pet rat after her. And like, I'm so annoyed that it's called the whole... And obviously it's just a pronunciation error. That was me, I just want to get my own car. Thing is, I don't know how these can we end up with do we have to exit career mode to get these loot boxes and things? Because I seen them as I was coming into the career mode. I don't know if there's any sort of way to do it outside. I don't think I've earned enough money to um, do it, but I'm thinking of doing the. There's an online road to glory. Um, so I might just do that, like not live, um, unlock some stuff, and then we'll do my character up in the next episode, I think. That's. Um, oh, I forget these guys' names. Sanity, that's it. Let me guess we've got to talk to Baron Blade again. No, oh, that's a surprise. I'm trying to see if we fall over the chair. That's, um, oh, what's that guy's name? It's Maso Champa, that's it.
Ahora ni por aquí. Ni por el vasco, güey. Voy. I bet it's gonna be a promo. Gosh, but God, there we go. What we probably give us options what to do. Um Do I wanna do a promo? No, I feel like we'll do a match. I, I just feel like a match. Ooh, we've got a win. It's kind of weird they put someone who's like quite well developed in NXT at the moment against like someone who's like sort of well, I wouldn't say sort of a new new to the show. But I suppose if they build you up for a title shot, that's what they would do actually. Welcome to NXT. Coming to you live from Orlando, where the attractions are many, but the only one that matters right now is WWE. If you even think about changing that channel, you'll regret it. Stay tuned. Well, considering this is on a network, Cole, no one's changing any channel. Well, I suppose you could. We have a great match well, coming up next. turn WWE Network off. We have one of the best talents well, on the roster America, today um, against on the an channel. imposing adversary. Oh, other we are going anywhere. Outside of the UK, we have to watch it on the network. I must admit, it's one of the best things about the network. It's one of the reasons I um, like keep subscribing to it. That and the pay-per-views. It's nice they've done it that way because it's, it's before I don't have um, well, I could get Sky Sports, but just for, like Raw and SmackDown, it wouldn't be worth it for me. So it's nice to keep up to date with things. I, I feel like we've seen Making um, his way from Northridge, California, weighing in at... We've seen his entrance. And his opponent, from Tampa, Florida, Weighing in at 200 pounds, Roderick Strong. They call him the Messiah of the Backbreaker. Ladies Rick and gentlemen, Strong. here's Roderick Strong. Somehow, Michael, he seemingly oh, comes up with a new Backbreaker oh, wow. every time we see him. No running then. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard really not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. Coming in. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure. It was actually quite a cool entrance scene. He got back in the ring quick. Right. Singles action is underway, I and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to break what's going to happen. I'd just through. be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. Ooh. Man, this card is just packed with so many great matches, he, like, and this one is definitely shot. among the most anticipated, I'd say. Judging from this crowd response, guys, there's no more magical place to be in Orlando right now than right here for this match. This was. I don't think he should get up. In the last match about my character. Um, it might be worth mentioning a little well, bit about sort of Stone here. So if you were him, what him, what would you do to win this thing? Ten, I think it was. Going to take a lot to beat him tonight, Michael. Um, From what I'm told, he's been spending Bully. extra hours in the gym in anticipation um, of getting in the ring with this guy. Well, the WWE Universe is Person filled with amazing one. talent, as this match definitely shows. I, mean, I did have a I still, I think I still have it to this day. I had the PlayStation 2 version originally. And then I just got playing through. Apparently, I'd like more content and things. And I just thought, oh, we'll have a look at it. And I remember there's a character I can't remember the guy's name, but there's like a, it's really big black dude. Wow! What a powerful I just thought toss. That guy would make a good wrestling character. So that's why I used his image um, on 
the job because originally he, he was just like he's in a little bit of trouble even, now like, i'm not sure how much more he has to give he was i'd never count this guy out but i'll tell you what really he's not looking so hot right now yeah. he's really gonna need to find a way to get back in this thing hey he can still win this thing guys we've all seen him come back from much worse and uh, i did put a foot uniform on him um one of his things but he's not looking foot. good here Byron he no he's got to get up and he's got to get up now he just had like um, shoulders down like, is it enough he's a long way from a three bombing. count I can tell you that yeah he's not done yet start with and he took the jacket off when he was in the ring and that's where he first started out and then I remember replaying Legends of Wrestlemania and there was like I think it was uh, Jim Duggan used to do like this like Sort of tackle finishing move. And just like that, this move is and leading the charge. Imagine if you had a football uniform, and that's where the football uniform thing comes from. And I used that on the character I made him on there, and um, used it because that was that came out before SmackDown vs Raw 2010, I think. 2009, I think. I love how they've got the crowd saying this. It's really, really spot on. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. One move after the other. It's devastating. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason like to lose your foot well, on a move like that. Let's say you Come want on, to play with different up. characters. You can sort of do that and you can use them to play online and everything. It's brilliant. I really like what they've done. Before. Can you just do this move? I always feel so on edge when like, doing this on putting this out on YouTube because you just want the matches to be interesting. This guy is actually He's deep. in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's gonna get a lot tougher. That's a, I don't, I'm gonna have to have a look how you do the stats because this is like so annoying that but it's even got it. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. This can go a variety of different oh, ways, Corey, stamina. and almost none of them are good. Check out Roderick Strong's offense. Reverses that one. Man, that got him good. He landed a perfectly placed strike. That'll send a message to your adversary, all right. Showing an aggressive side here. He's still not moving, guys. He might be out, Cole. Can you get turned up off him? Bad move there. What was that? I don't know what made him think that was a good idea. No, I don't know what made me think that was a good idea. And now he goes for it a second time. I don't know if you can actually can hear the commentary. Gosh, this is like that old battery commercial. This move just oh, keeps going and going and going, going and going and going. Build me stomach on my dream bro. Same. Yes, yeah, thank you, Mr. Muscle. Let's get this move done. Looks like trouble here, Byron. I don't know. I guess that all depends on who you're rooting for. He's simply reminding oh. him that he's here. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Oh, that's quite a good move. We know he's what's got, like, coming move. there. It's like a, a touchdown in American football. There's no recovery like from that. Wow, I'm just as surprised as like you move. guys are. Come on, Roger yeah. Strong. You can do this. He's in trouble. Oh, what a slam! Planet. It's more of a Let's rock look at the replay. We'll call nice move off. right there. It could be over here. Oh, just inches, millimeters from a three count. Look at the look on his opponent's person, face, Cole. He can't believe it.
Because I, I think it was in like SmackDown vs. Raw 2010. You had like you had to make a costume for your entrance, your ring in ring, and there was a cutscene. Showing very one. few signs of life here. Oh, yeah, why there's did no I do way that again? he comes back from this. Might as well ring the bell now. I can't believe he kicked out of that though. That's just... This should do it right there. Gentleman's How in the like world that. did he kick out there? He needs to change something fast, guys. This could be it for him, guys. Yeah, he's on Dream Street. Pays for that one. Oh, and he reverses it. Just making his presence felt there. The Steiner recliner. No, oh, I hate these submission things. I can never Back get and that. forth we go. If I lose here, I'm going to get well cheesed off. I'm going to be cheesed off, old chap. Ooh. Oh, and he breaks free. But the damage might have already been done, Michael. And it's reversed. Oh, that should be his finisher. What was that? Soldiers down. You know this what could that be was, it. but that should oh, be man, a finisher, surely. I am in shock. Oh, that was amazing. What's it going to take to keep this up. guy down? It was like a, a, a reverse grapple. He's not getting up. In a minute. You that can't more like, like his chances right now. Chain. Getting his attention oh, with a did, vicious strike. I was going to have a spear as his other finisher, but it just feels like everybody's got that move. A bit of contempt coming through on that slam. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Oh, no. Um, Look at this. Ooh. And he goes for the pin. And he kicks out. I think he had anything, but not like that. I like Very the pin system. I kick. prefer that style of pin system to the older one we used to have. But I'm not always really good at it. But then it makes it more exciting. Just an unforgiving slam. He slams him down with authority. So the referee just actually bent down to have a look at his backside and I'm not being... I mean, if it floats his boat, it's up to him, but a bit odd. Will he be victorious? He got it. No. Oh, you're Kick having a giraffe. Too. I can't believe it. He just won't You're having a laugh, me old no him now. Oh, you know that isn't going to land. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. One of the characters in last year's career mode had, like, some springboard moves and things. I think that's what I'm sort of used to. These guys are giving it their all here tonight, not just to entertain the fans, but to ultimately walk away with the win. Oh! I don't even know what that is. Yeah, that locked in tight, guys. This could be it. And he fights his way free. He's got to be working on instinct right now, Cole. And we're back to this form of attack. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. I don't think if he kicks out, it wouldn't surprise me. He is a one man oh. game in there. Oh, oh, oh. what a leg he might just be out, guys. So like he, missed it. he hasn't moved one bit. here doesn't show any signs do of getting up here guys no he's taking one heck of a beating michael
Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint player. of weakness in the other. Have I got an outside signature? Yeah. Here he goes. Is he going for a pedigree? Big spot in the match here. Just when you pedigree. thought he had nothing left. Hey, what goes up must come down. Oh. Come on, Roddy. Let's get in, son. He wants no part That's of the it. outside. Ray, it's a signature and beats me. I can see He's it. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. Let's look at this one more time, Cole. Great officiating. Oh, oh you're to the again. Ropes. That's just Gonna be tough for him to fight back from this. Oh, the first thing he needs to do. Got it cinched in. The STF is cinched in. Oh, he's gonna reverse it. He's gonna reverse it. He breaks it. I can't believe oh, it. I can't go go believe I'm gonna say time. this, but I'm with you, Cole. So unbelievable that he broke out of that. He may have discovered his favorite move. The unfortunate reality is he might not get up. Which wouldn't shock me one bit. Talk about a beating he's taken here tonight. We haven't seen this move since the start of the episode. I think. Well, the start of this match, even. Looking for the finish. He can't withstand one bit more. Made him pay there. That'll leave you dizzy in a hurry. Hoping to end it early. No, we're in a five star now. No, four star. Four and a half star. Stone finds himself in a tough spot. You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. Guys, one of my favorite things about him is how much pride he has in his game. And up until now, he's had plenty to be proud about. Oh, he missed. That's it. Just have a lie down. Son. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. Well, he missed I and just had a sleep on him. Anymore. It's like, I need a rest. I'm going to lie down on you. You make a good pillow. When this That's guy's treating on, me like a pillow. Look out. He has him right where he wants him. Look at it a second time. Now that's how you make a statement. This one's over, guys. Oh, oh but he's still down, Byron. But this one Things isn't it. They definitely aren't looking wrong. very good for him right now. This has got to be it. We're not An near emphatic the ropes. finisher. Here's his moment, We're nowhere Michael. near the ropes. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Two, three. What a way to win a singles match. I do like watching the re I mean, if you're going to show things, do you really need to show him getting dragged around? Which finish was that? It was like the 37th one I did. Even the referees count as a replay. Well, that kind of was a replay because he did keep. Here is your out. winner, yeah. Jackson Stone. What's going I, on I, here? I feel like he I don't think get... she's going to keep us wondering for long. I feel like he would use Roderick Strong as like to signalise what's going to happen to Bobby Roode. I'm just being cool. I'm not going to lie. He is a one-man gang in there. I, I really hate these moves that are like they look good in the ring but they just don't look so good on the outside. Going for broke! This will probably be our end. Pile driver oh. spiked him. That's what he was looking for, Michael. That's for you, Rude. 
<laughs> oh, I do love, love WWE when they have glitches. I really do. I don't know if you can hear the music, it's Bruno Mars. Not really a big fan, but it's sometimes it is. Some of these songs can be a bit. You hear them so many times, you just sort of like find yourself whistling along and stuff. It's mad. See how that goes down. Oh, he's happy with that. Old Brock Lesnar Jr. there. Damn right you heard it. See uh, Brock Lesnar Jr. That's what I'm going to call him because he does kind of look like him. We'll see who's crazy. Right, I think that's where we're going to leave this one for today. So, thank you very much for watching. Thank you. Good night, March 5th. No, I do I stop? There is a way to, um, I can't even remember how to end this, that's really poor, ah there we go.